back to Sly 2 Band of Thieves. Episode 7. Menace in the North. Hey. Okay, let's go in. We got a job to do. Things just weren't right up in Canada. Random acts of violence were popping uh. up like weeds, and the northern lights, well, they just weren't right. One night they'd be brighter than ever, and the next, gone. In Nunavut Bay, I overheard talk between Jean Besson and his mysterious partner, Arpeggio. Uh. Somehow, those two are behind it all. Tracking the source of the disturbance was easy. By simply following the lights, we were led north to an immense lumber camp. The sheer number of fallen trees advertised Jean Besson's presence and that he was in possession of the clockwork talons. Uh. The Thievius Raccoonus makes numerous references to the talons slicing through plates of steel. A skilled lumberjack like Besson could clear a forest in hours while wielding the artifacts. Yeah. Ah. Those talons <laughs> have got to go. Both to finally do away with clockwork and to save the environment from his twisted sense of progress. The world just doesn't need to make space for another strip mall. <laughs> uh, Sly Cooper and the gang in Menace of the North, eh? Alright then. Let's see what's available. Okay, we got... Well, I, I just bought whatever that was for Bentley, and now I can't afford anything else. <laughs> oh, well. Okay, so here's what we know. Uh -huh. One, Arpeggio's blip is on its way to pick up a battery from Jean Bisson. Hmm. And two, the only way we'll get a crack at Arpeggio's clockwork brain is by finding a way to sneak aboard his blip. But before we do that, We'll need to snag the clockwork talents off John Besson. Time is short, and we've got a lot to accomplish. True, true, but first things first. This lumber camp isn't on any of my maps. Hmm. I need you to poke around and take some recon photos. They'll help to get my sensors oriented. No problem. Recon photos, I got covered. Okay. In anticipation of the icy climate, I took the liberty of modifying your cane. It can now separate into two smaller canes. Useful for ice climbing. Try ascending to the top of that sheet of ice. Just jump and hit the circle button to dig in. <laughs> you know, I was half expecting Sly just to go like, wait, you took my ancestral cane and tore it apart and put it back together? Uh, that's about the size of it. Cool, what to do? <laughs> okay, safe house logo. I hear you, where are you? Hello! Ah, the ducks are back! Curse you, Mallard! Curse you! The Mallard, it's back! Ah! Eagles! Shiny pockets! Loot! You know, I half expected you to see me there. <laughs> but you didn't see me take your ruby, did you? Also die! Goodbye! Swing! Ah! <laughs> Probably should have double jumped. There we go. Hmm. You know, Frank, it's not good just to stand out there on the ice. It's probably not a great idea. Tunnel here, yeah, I hear you. Where are you? Not this way. Literally just made fun of him being on the ice, now he went on the ice. Oh, there it is! And whoop! No, no! Woo! <gasps> I don't. What just happened? <laughs> what is. One second.
My controller's acting weird. There we go. That was weird. Ah, the eagles! It's the eagles! Ah! Why did you destroy the outhouse? Bye! Yep! Okay then. Hello, little friend. Just gonna. Ooh. Ah. Hmm. Oh. Probably should actually start the mission. It'll make things easier. Darn eagle! Bentley, how did you do this? I don't know. Anyway. It's good to see my cane upgrade perform so well in the field. Now, scout the area. <laughs> I could really use the reconnaissance. Okay, spots of interest. Jeez, eagles, man. They're everywhere. Ooh. Okay. I have a feeling there might be something on one of these boats. Probably wrong, but it's not a bad idea to check it out. I was absolutely wrong. And whoop. I'm not gonna make that. Yeah, didn't make it. Whoop. Over here. You don't see me on this outhouse. I'm practically invisible. Invisible. Uh, it doesn't look like there's anything on the boat. Hello! How's it going, Bottle? My old friend? Woo. Hi, how's it going? Go our way and die! Hmm. Hello! Okay, got that. Whoop. Just gotta avoid the deadly logs of death. You know, a classic thing to avoid. You don't see anything, I'm gone. Bye. You see nothing. I don't exist. Don't exist. I'm gone, like the wind. Ooh. Yet that's not cold cold enough to kill me. Oh, and the bears are back! Hello, bear! Bear! Ow. Did you just hit me? I am nearly dead. Oh. Okay, then. You need to die. For coins. Okay, how am I gonna get this? Like that! Huzzah! Okay. 11 down, 29 to go. Twenty-eight to go. Thanks for the health! Okay, I found an item. That's... I heard that. Oh, I hear it. It's above it. How do I... Okay, long way around time. Really? Wait. I should have vanished. I really wanted your pocket, but you're alive. But you're alive? I meant, like, I can't. Never mind. Just get up here. Every time a shiny pocket shows up, I just happen to. 
You know, I'm, I'm not having... I'm not having good luck. Well, I already hit him once, so... Hmm. Oh, there's one right there. I'll have to come back and get it. Okay, now I just have to precariously climb on these... Ice... I'll be honest, I don't even know what these are. Ice claws? Coming out of the side of the mountain. Or, correction, this is probably like a glacier. Anything on the inner side? And that's a nope. Okay. Hmm. Just make my way back. Collect up some good old, uh, you know, good old, uh, Anything, like, is there one on these? Before I, like, get off it? Might be a good idea to check. No, it doesn't look like it. Go away! No, I really could have used health! Thanks for nothing! <gasps> shiny pocket, shiny pocket, shiny pocket! Shiny pocket, shiny pocket! Give me that nugget! Yeah! Give me your destruction! Okay, there's one right there. Awesome! Now there was one on the other side. How did you not see me? Well, not gonna look at Gift Horse and the Mouse. Gift Horse and the Mouse? What? Sometimes I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Uh, okay. 16 down. I'm over halfway there. Hmm. Woo! Almost missed that. Just gotta keep an eye out. Hi, friend. How's it going? Thank you. Take that. The bottle made more noise than his death. Hey, look, another one. And another one. Do, 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 and. I wasn't here. I heard that duck sound. They only make duck sounds when they hear ya. <laughs> Maybe. Hmm. Ah! Why well, do I have a feeling there's probably one up there? Well, I'll check there if there's if I can't find any more. <laughs> okay. You know, I should expect that to happen. You see nothing! Just like this mallard sees nothing! Hmm. Darn eagles! <gasps> you know, that one's my own fault. <laughs> Swing! Okay. Hmm. Let's check out that lighthouse. There's one. And got it. Ten left. Just gotta make my way over. Ugh. I wonder what's on that. Whoa, they melt! I didn't know they melted! I wonder what's over there. That's not to say, but. A lot of stuff just, uh, lying around, you know? Oh, there we go. Did I, like, not see you when I first came over here? Also, 
also die. Ah, glorious health. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything down here. Can I climb the structure? Hmm. Ah! The ice. Probably something on the top. Knowing Cooper logic. Also giant icicles. That's fun. Uh. Woo. Also, is this ice melting? Hey, look at Chalice. I hear it. Okay. What I needed. Yes. It must be piloted by computer. That boat. <laughs> that boat right there. Okay, I'm too far away for anything else, though. That's funny. Okay. I can make that. Oh, I'm on a job. I have to come back for it. Hmm. Did I check around here for anything? You heard nothing. I don't hear anything. All right, then. Moving on. Hello. Shiny pocket. Okay. Woo. He's going to turn. He's going to turn. No, he's not. Do not turn on me. Ruby! Yes! You've served your purpose. And I found the last treasure. Really? I love that. Then our plate. And I'm gone. Okay, there's one over here. Oh no! Darn logs! Okay, there's nothing up here, but there is something over here. Almost there. Just four more bottles. Ooh, that was close. You would have saw me. Oh, come on! I could have landed that. Maybe. The bear? Did I did I piss off the bear? Oh. Get him, bear! Get him! I believe in the bear that believes in you! Oh crap, I'm down here with the bear. Hello there. Now how do I get you? Probably. Uh, there we go. Oh, almost there. To remain. Probably over that way. My luck and photo. John B. Sod's house. The lair of the beast. The dead of evil. <laughs> the epicenter of ecological destruction. <laughs> Looks cozy. Anyway. <laughs> Unlike our shack. Wait. Why does our shack have a glass front? He just look in and see us. Like, is that that Cooper gang? Okay, where is the bear? That's strange. There we go. 
Bear. This place is bear country, all right. Interesting. He's putting out a slight radio signature. Huh? Interesting. Okay, last thing's probably... Oh! That... That poor fellow. Yeah! Stuck it! <laughs> 29! One left! Only one bottle remains. Hmm. Found it! Woo! Of course, the last bottle screw me over! Ooh. Can I get the picture from here? Now I'm too far away. Up we go! Excuse me, tree! Excuse me, duck! Don't you dare throw rocks at me! Ugh, I'm off. Okay, here we go. What? That is the perfect shot! What are you talking about, game? Now I gotta get away up there. Well, here's a way. Oh, maybe. Can I jump up there? Guess not! Hey, look at Mammoth. Anyway. <laughs> Lovely Mammoth. And we're off. Woo! My feet are cold. Ooh. Got it! <laughs> Those saw blades look particularly old. I guess this logging camp has been around for a while. <sighs> Okay, that should yep. do it. I'm dead. Now for the real point of interest. Head for that lighthouse and try to find a way to sneak in. Ooh. I guess we're off the lighthouse then. Okay, I'm going to have to keep an eye out for that vault. So it looks like... This is also one that's probably linked to, uh... It's probably in John Bassan's house. <laughs> I mean, that makes sense, actually. Okay, now I just have to, uh... Oh, I can't go in... Yeah, I can't go in the safe house where I give up my, uh... Current mission. I was gonna stop there and get health! Maybe get a cookie! So long, farewell, Avita, say goodbye. Okay. <laughs> we swing to and fro, we swing left and right. Oh, your pocket shiny. Wait for it. He will totally hear me if I do it right now. Eh, it was worth a shot. Sapphire! <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs> I don't know why I find that funny. I bet you I'm- Oh no! I bet you I'm gonna have to climb to the top of the lighthouse. Yeah, I'm gonna have to, time to, have to climb to the top. Oh! Hello! <gasps> I mean, never mind. Apparently there was a little hole. Oh, hi, John. John! What is... Battery charger? That's the battery charger, but where's the battery?
Sorry, arpeggio's coming to pick up. Hmm. Oh no. It's unbreakable. A chair! John, you ruined my shot. I was right. The entrance is barred from the inside. The most impenetrable of forces. We'll never get in. Even Murray can't break that. Okay. Zoom a little closer. Wait for it. No. A little closer. Oh, come on. Work with me. Okay. You are the worst fo- I can't think of the phrase. Ah! Got it. Just looking at that spinner makes me dizzy. Beautiful! Might as well get a shot of old Jean Bisson. Okay, Jean. There we go. Oh, Sly, listen in. He's mumbling to himself. Come on, Jean. You got it in you. Those lumberjack games need some more competition, eh? What would attract the participants? Bullseye! I'll post the clockwork talons as a trophy. That should bring in the competition. Although, who am I kidding, eh? I'm gonna win just like every other year. <laughs> oh, it's tough being this tough. It sure is, yeah. Huh. Head back to the safe house. We need to talk about these lumberjack games. Well, that's convenient. Also, job completed. Sly, yay. Well, guys, Jean Bisson has unknowingly thrown down the gauntlet. With the Clockwork Talons as a trophy, we'd be fools not to participate in his lumberjack games. Fortunately, due to frequent avalanches, a log chopping guide was frozen in a wall of ice not far from our position. Huh. Sly, you're in charge of acquiring the book. Okay. I'm sure it will prove invaluable. <laughs> now, we're all aware that Arpeggio's blimp is coming to pick up another battery. To sneak aboard without incident, I'd recommend we pull a Trojan horse and stow away inside the battery. Huh. However, the location of the device is still a mystery. We need some inside information. Mm. So, working together, you two will infiltrate the Moose Guard's secret RC combat club. Those guys all work in the lighthouse. If you win the battle, I'm sure they'll talk. Despite his antique mind, Jean Bisson's no fool. To keep tabs on him, we'll need to bug his house, steal the radio tags off local bears, and then jerry-rig them into a sensor array. It's a challenging set of tasks, and that blimp's on its way. Let's get to work. We have a time limit, guys. We gotta do this. Let's sell some stuff, though. Not have to buy anything. Okay. Memory mission, slime mission, slime mission. Bear cave bugging, laser root direction, and RC combat. Okay, first things first. I'm getting my treasures. One top of the lighthouse, which is actually gonna be really easy to do. I just glide off the lighthouse and bear. <laughs> bear in mind, this is bear country if, after all. Okay, one of them is on Jambasan's house. Woo! That is not safe at all. Someone should really be on icicle duty. I'm just saying. If I was Jean Bisson, I'd have someone on icicle duty. Their job, bring off all the icicles so no one gets hurt. Okay. Okay, first treasure obtained. Now what is the safest way back to the hideout? I have an idea. He just has to turn around. Like so. I'm not here. Not here. 
Okay, this was a bad idea. Because bear. Ooh. Okay, made it there. Hmm. That could work. Just gonna... There we go. Ah. I mean, no wonder the bears around here are apparently tagged. They're everywhere. And in we go! Whew! How much for it, Bentley? Thief reflexes. Slows time to a crawl. Press X to purchase the... This what? Okay. Sounds cool. Okay, I got the one there. So the next one will be... In the lighthouse. Leave me alone, you birds! Leave me alone! Oh, I'm just on watch too! How are you alive? And apparently I have, uh, ditched them. Hmm. Come on, move! Just keep going, just keep going, just keep going. A little bit farther. Thank you! And now nobody can stop me! Except for the guy guarding the lighthouse. He can still stop me! But no one else! Woo. Okay then. He has a shiny pocket. Shiny? Oh shiny. Treasure, tr treasure, treasure is mine. Ooh, large gold bar. Die. Okay, just keep climbing, just keep climbing. We got this. This is a, ah. You know, I don't like giant icicles. They're not fun. Of course, they're probably not supposed to be fun. They're supposed to be deadly. Deadly giant icicles. Okay, how far can I glide with this? Come on. And get right there. Whoop. Huh. Run. Just run. I'm gonna make it! I'm gonna make it! Oh, <laughs> did the eagles attack them? Attack them flashlight guards too! Uh, Alright. With that last item, I should be able to afford uh, Murray's upgrade. Oh, uh, up we go. Because of recon, I already know where it is. Over here, on the other side of the camp, and a shiny pocket. Curse me and my habit of stealing all the shiny stuff. Sapphire. I see your pocket too, don't move. I said don't move, which means, which means I actually bump into you. Forget I exist, please. Ah, worth it. Also die. Ooh, not here. <laughs> Sometimes it's just better to pickpocket and run. Last treasure should be right over... There. Maybe? Did I miss it? No, I think it's over here. 
Yeah, okay. In 45 seconds. Why? Why, bear? Why, bear? Actually, I think the bear took them out. Thank you, bear. No, eagle. Okay. And I got it. Whew. Ugh. Okay, Sly. First things first. Let's do bear cave. Oh. Hmm. Hello there, friend. Goodbye there, friend. Just gotta make my way over here. Don't see me, Mr. Duck. And your shiny pocket's mine! Eh, it's Topaz. I won't pass on it. Ah. I use the truck. Truck, let me jump on you. Ah! <gasps> you also have a shiny pocket. Just gonna borrow this for a good minute for some nugget. Yeah. Uh, activate mission. <laughs> the area have been tagged with radio tracking devices. Mm -hmm. If you could snag enough of them, we should be able to set up a receiver array around ah. Jean Bisson's house. I'm always up for bugging someone's home. The well, first step is crawling into that bear cave and stealing the goods. I'm on it. Okay. I mean, it can't be too hard, right? Oh wait, they're bears. Indestructible. Nothing can stop bears! Uh. The radio transmitters have all been tagged in their mouth. Uh. You'll have to sneak up and pickpocket it while they're yawning. What? Sounds safe. Stay <laughs> clear of the thin, crackly ice. Walking on it is sure to wake the bears. I'll keep that in mind. Uh, sounds perfectly safe. Come on, open your mouth. Open that. There we go. Wait, am I pulling at his whole tooth? I am stealing their teeth! That has gotta hurt! I'm really surprised this isn't waking you up! Just yoink the whole tooth out of their mouth! Yoink the whole thing! Thank you! Sly Cooper, amateur dentist. Oh, I see what you want me to do. But how is this not gonna wake them? Like, I'm making a lot of noise here. Okay, uh, yawn! Whew. Wow, I'm actually, uh, doing pretty good. Just two left. And not a single bear woke this night. Yep, okay, open your mouth. Thank you. Much appreciated. Ooh. I almost hit that. That would have been bad. Huh. Last one? Last one, please. Thank you. Huh. Only you could have pulled that off. Head outside and I'll fill you in on the next step. Woo. Okay. But wait, if that's the only way out, how do the bears get out of here? That's my question. Are they just stuck in here? Poor bears. They're just stuck. In a cave. Forever. To form a receiver array, you'll have to place the radio mm -hmm. transmitters in precise locations around Jean Bisson's base of operations. Seems okay. easy enough. Once you're in position, hit the circle button to place the transmitter. All right. Okay, let's see. Oh. 
Ah, specific locations around the base. On it. No! Darn water. Sly's number one weakness. Even though technically he should be immune to water because of... I mean, I've probably already brought this up. But... Oh well. Whew. There we- That is a solid tooth! I was ripping the teeth right out of their mouths! That confirms it. No! You know, sometimes... I forget this actual- this pole right here is here. Which allows me to do that. And I go around the whole thing. Figuring out where to go. Well, I'll just run. See ya, fellas! Can they get up here? Probably not. They can't. Like, they probably looked at each other. You gonna report it? No. Well, we'll get him next time. Next time, Sly Cooper. I'm actually looking to see if that... I know I probably already checked, but I'm, I'm double-checking to see if the safe thing pops up. Okay. And there's one. Perk up your ears, boys. I'm gonna tell you all the tally for last month. The blue lumberjack team managed to clear cut 128 acres of forest. Huh. Not bad, considering they had to kill all them badgers to do it, man. <gasps> He's made it a game. He's made... He's made lumberjacking a game. I mean, make it fun for the employees. <laughs> Kinda. There we go. Okay, which one am I missing? Okay, I'm actually missing all of them on that side, looks like. What hit me? Well, nothing hit me, but something hit, like, around me. Wasn't the bear... I would have noticed if it was the bear. Okay, just put it right here. There we go. Last one is... Oh, right over there. And... Glide! There we go. Nice work. The array's up and running. Job complete! Sly, yeet! Okay, Sly so finished his job. Next is over there. Okay, how do I get... Ah! Didn't see anything, duck. Uh... Yeah. Oh. Dip and dodge, man! Dip and dodge! Ooh! Okay, the next one's right over there. Just a hop, skip, and a jumping away. And a powerful avoid bear. Be cautious of bears. Bears are scary. Oh, okay. In we go. <laughs> Didn't know that opened. Detected what appears to be an ancient guide to log chopping that might be useful for the lumberjack games. Unfortunately, it's frozen deep in an ice wall. How are we supposed to get to it? Wait for more global warming? That industrial laser is used to cut through petrified logs. If it could be bounced out that window, huh. with your help, I should be able to harness its energy to melt the ice wall and free the bug. How do I redirect that thing? There should be a switch on the other side of this wall. 
throw it and then head outside. All right. Also, how do you detect an ancient book of log chopping? Bentley. Like, that's an actual question. How, how did you detect that? Also, is the vault in here? <laughs> I feel like this is a very vaulty kind of area. Hmm. Look around. You have a shiny pocket. Thank you for the necklace. Die. I can use health. Yep, I was right. It's right there. Okay, he's gone. Now I can do this. If I did my bath right, and I always do my bath right, then the combination has got to be five, eight, three. Five, eight, and trace. Uh, I was here. Lightning spin, ooh. Yeah, Zooks, that's a nice one. Is it? What's it do? Tell me. Attention all you fellas work on the sawmill. Make sure you Ooh. keep a steady watch. A prowler's been spotted. And we cannot afford to have anything happen to our log cut equipment. Particularly mm. that laser type saw blade. <laughs> We're gonna need it once we get to them old oaks up near Lookout Mountain. Well hey, you know, you should still enjoy yourself, thank you. I mean, how many people get to cut down forests for a living? Ha <laughs> ha, you all are lucky. Don't ever forget that. Okay, uh, what's this do? Uh... Okay, that's literally it. Neat! Yeah, felt like that was going to do that. Your pocket! Sir, I need that pocket! for uh, research and other things and give me what's in it, Sapphire. Also die. We don't need these anymore. Or oh, this chair. Throw the switch. You've done it. The laser's been redirected out the window. All right, oh, job not done? Okay, let's keep going. <laughs> Sly, that's only the first part of the job. L ladder, L ladder. Out we go. Now to get that laser pointed at the ice wall, you'll need to alter its direction with the crystals I put hmm. in your pouch. I see. I just walk to where the laser stops, place a crystal, and it'll bounce the beam to a new position. The huh. log chopping book is as good as ours. All right. Question. Will the laser stay on the map when this is over? Because it looks like it'd be pretty funny just to have uh, lasers just going around. Like guards going through like, oh, to do it. oh, laser. Why is there a random laser? I mean, the teeth are still here, so maybe. Also, probably shouldn't touch it. Touching the lasers have never gone well for me. Never has. Probably never will. Ooh, health. <laughs> Useful. Okay, it's over there. Alright, just gotta get over here. Ah! Okay then. <laughs> I wanted to get in a better position, but apparently the thing just broke. I mean, I'll take it. And... Really? <laughs> Why is it going all the way over there? Seriously? 
You guys really like using the- going to the outhouse. <laughs> Just hanging out in there for long periods of time. Okay, how do I get up there? Hmm. Hello! It might be a little bit roundabout, but it's the best way to get up there. Eagles. Eagles! Release it. There we go. Actually, this might not work. Nope! Did not work! Oh, there's a way over here. Alright then. Hi, how's it going? Bye! Yep. They already forgot about poor Dave. Poor Dave! He wasn't worth remembering. <laughs> That's awful. Uh. Just avoid the bear. Avoid the bear. No need to bother the bear. It's just the bear. Also, it might be more dangerous to just walk around this place after we're done than to bear! I have angered him! But apparently he also forgot about me. You didn't do anything. Run! Run! How's house gonna explode? Not this time! Ugh! Hey! Eh? Watch it! Oh, it's up there again! Well, you know what they say. Up, up, and away! Alley-oop! Hook! There we go! You have a shiny pocket! This is not gonna work, this is not gonna- OH MY GOSH I GOT IT! <laughs> it's literally an upgrade to my, uh, other move. And I like it! I accept this upgrade. It's a good upgrade. Oh, this is gonna be one of those breaks, isn't it? There we go. There's that. How did he detect this? I I still don't know. Okay. Oh. Uh, what? Else is what? Out of the deep Mammoth. I've never seen such a majestic creature. So full of life. So ready to live. So much for that. <laughs> He's back in the deep freeze. Did, did he just fall in the water? Why would he just run into the water? Up, pal. We got the log chopping guide. Job completed. Slide eight. But why would he run back in the water? I I don't under. You know. Some things you just don't understand in life, and some things you just do. Maybe he liked being an icicle. Apparently. But I wonder where he went. Do you think he's somewhere on the map? Yep. Okay, switching out. Murray, it's time to rumble. RC style. Okay. Wait, you have, uh, you got a new move, didn't you? Well, that worked. Good job, Murray. The Murray can't be stopped by flashlight guards because the Murray is getting ready to go play some RC cars. As soon as I can get up this cliff. There we go. Rumor has it that several off-duty guards meet in that cabin for an RC combat club. Hmm. This is going to be great. I haven't been in any RC combat since that job we pulled in Istanbul. <laughs> it was awesome. I want. I, can, can we, like. Is there, like, any way we could ever, like. I wish they would make another Sly Cooper game. Make it, like, a prequel to Sly Cooper 3. 
or four. Like, make it appear cool to this game. I mean, then we'd just be playing a slide, because literally the first game, the first mission of this game was the first time Bentley came into the field, and the first time I think Murray came in the field? Anyway. Those guards will never let you into the combat club without uh. the disguise. That old moose head should do uh. the thing. Only there's no way for you to get up there. What? Hide out in this barrel while I send in Sly to steal the head. Wait, wait, wait. M I, I don't want to... I. Get in the barrel, B Murray. Murray, get in the... Murray, just get in the barrel. I... I Why, if you can get the stuffed moose head without being what? detected, Murray should be able to join the RC combat club Does... without raising any suspicion. Oh, okay. Now, I, I have a couple of questions about that moose head. Um, first off, it's a stuffed moose head. And these are all moose... Guards, right? Uh. So. Hey, it's it's Tim's head. Yeah, he had to, when he died, he wanted to be a stuffed moose head. Why? Mm hmm. We never questioned it. It was just Tim. Okay. Maybe it's not as weird as I'm thinking. Maybe I'm overthinking it. Who knows? Okay, uh, camera. Shiny pocket, shiny pocket. Treasure will be mine. Afraid if I actually get into any fights here, I will ruin the mission. Ooh, that, that's gonna, yep. Called it, that was gonna move. Ah, more saw blades. No! <laughs> I fell. Nobody's here, regards. Just your average raccoon! Ooh. Okay, let's, let's, let's try this again. You know, I understand this is a logging place, but why is everything still moving? Like, don't you guys turn this stuff off when not in use? I'm just saying. Seems like kind of like a waste to keep it going all the time. And what is this? Uh. Oh God. This is this is pure horror. Okay. Okay, go to sleep, buddy. There we go. I spy with my little eye something shiny. Okay. There are more guards. So many guards. This place is just chock full of people. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Okay. Da, 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 da. Oh my god, it... Wait. Is it? It has a hat! This is just someone's head! Ah! Oh, this is weird! Go! Murray, heads up. Slide, did the guard up there not hear you say that? Ah! Hey, fellas. <laughs> And if you guys think you can beat the moose, the, the moose, maybe put a bet on it. Oh, I'm in, eh? I ain't got a lot of money for this wager, but there's no way I'd lose to a new guy like you, huh? This is this is actually kind of weird. Combat drone takes some skill to control. Steer with the left analog stick and moose hold head. down the X button for gas. What? After you collect the fallen ammo. Press the square button to fire its turret. There's a pro tip. You can only aim the turret while you're stopped.
Oh, I'm taking damage. Not go well. Not well at all. Yep. Nope. Oh, thank you. Eh? No! What are you doing? Why does it hurt? Take that direct hit. What? Well, you won, eh? What? But I ain't got no money. That Did you? might be okay. It all depends. Depends on what? On whether or not you know the location of the Northern Light Battery. Oh well, I guess I owe ya. Wait. Did he blow himself up? <laughs> job completed. Good job, Murray. <laughs> he blew himself up. <laughs> I got lucky. <sighs> After reading through the log shopping guide, it's become painfully clear that to win in the lumberjack games, we'll have to cheat. <laughs> now I've constructed a plan that hinges around us acquiring an eagle's egg. Hey, the island. Is more difficult than you Ugh. think. First, Murray needs to lure a bear into taking out the local oil mains. Once destroyed, the pressurized oil should ignite and create updrafts, which Sly will then use to paraglide over to the eagle's nest. Grab an egg, and then head back to the safe house. Ah. Thanks to Murray's undercover work in the RC Combat Club, we've learned that the Northern Light Battery is hidden in a silo nearby. Huh. The battery needs some serious modification if we're going to hide inside it to sneak onto Arpeggio's blip. First, we'll short the battery with grapple okay. lines on local boats. Hmm. Then, we'll all break into the lighthouse and sever the power flow to the battery. That way it won't recharge. All right. Given my electrical engineering background, this plan ah! has a 97% chance of success. Bentley, where'd Pretty you get that power. photo? <laughs> Bentley, where'd you get that photo? No, no, I'm just, this is some Photoshop, Sly. Just some Photoshop. For example, you know. Or just in case. Okay, Sly. What do we got here? We got ourselves, looks like a lighthouse break-in. Just three missions? One each? Perfect. Start with Sly then. You didn't see anything. Nothing at... Wubbubbooey! Hoorah. Dang, Eagle! Stupid eagles just coming down and attacking me like, like they own the place! Ah, curse you, eagle. Curse you! Okay. No, no, no. Climb. Climb. Okay, here we go. That lighthouse is the conduit for collecting the northern lights. Huh. We need to shut it down, or the silo battery will continue to fill with energy, making it impossible for us to stow away inside. Hmm. So, you want me to go in there and bust the thing up? Sounds like work for Murray. Actually, this job will require all three of our skills. Huh. The front door is locked, and you're the only one capable of climbing up to the hatch on top. That darn chair. Once inside, sneak down to the ground floor and let us in. We'll help you finish the job. All right, see you on the ground floor. All right. 
Let's do this. That chair has it coming. Things that can keep me out. Nothing keeps out Sly Cooper. Nothing. Especially not. Ow. Okay, appar uh, apparently. Apparently. Uh, icicles. Mm -hmm. Ah, thanks for the health, pal. Just keep climbing, just keep climbing, just keep climbing, climbing, climbing. Just, just be careful. Careful, Sly. This is our third time up this thing, and it's the first time you're actually hit by anything. Wait, it sounds like there's someone up here. Where did you come from? Get off this thing! You've made it up to the hatch! That was George. He likes to come up here and just look at the sea. So I knocked him off. <laughs> okay. Now what? Oh, I have to go to the bottom. Ooh. You know, this is why I stuck to the stairs, because of lightning, because the big red cloud kind of seemed like a bad thing. Shiny. Thank you. Clear techniques we enjoy today. That's it. Keep your axes sharp. And keep your ducks in a row. <laughs> Just keep Ow! Okay, I didn't notice that. What it kinda worked. I'll take it. Oh, and this chair thanks pal just let me at that northern line attractor it'll be slagging minutes not quite that simple Murray I'll reverse the energy flow from the control computer while you lift the main circuit breaker that should give Sly a short window of opportunity to climb up the power lines and overload the system from the top up down up down they should put an elevator in this place. <laughs> okay. Um, am I supposed to be, uh, climbing? I think I'm supposed to be climbing. Nope, 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 nope. We gotta keep going. Wait, is Spice powering? Get climbing, Sly. We can't keep this thing reversed forever. Yeah, this is heavier than it looks. Nope. I see how this works. Or not. Ooh. Yeah, they see me. I'm probably supposed to, like, kill them all before I do this, but... Flip the switch! Oh! Oh, that's not good. That is... We did it! The collection mechanism is overloading! We should probably leave before it explodes! Job completed! Sly, yeah! Okay. Oh, down we go! Haha! <laughs> 
Oh, can I not? I can't leave for the front door? That's not fair. That That's not fair. I want to leave. Let me leave, darn it. Well, at least this thing's broken, so it, it won't attack me anymore. Nope. Darn you. Okay, uh-huh. And should be the action. Ooh. Spotlights. You know, I thought maybe I could go through the front door. Nope. Have to go through the top. Oh well. It's not that much of a detour. Okay, just the Bentley and Murray missions left. Let's go take care of the Murray. Before it's too late. I don't know why it's too late, I just, that, I felt that was appropriate. Anyway, Murray time! There we go, climb up here, get over there, and watch out for the eagles! Okay. Murray! We're on the clock, buddy. Just... Insta death. Good job. I'm curious. Can I? Ha <laughs> Bear traps. Oh, health. Huh. Hey. Go away. And here we go. We're gonna get an eagle egg. You'll first have to destroy all the local oil mains. Mm. It looks pretty sturdy. All right. The Murray is strong, but his fists can't punch through metal. No problem. See that old bear down there? His name is Grizzleface. The guards ignore him because he's blind and practically nerve dead, except for his sense of smell. If that old guy smells fish, there's no stopping him. Use Grizzleface Ooh. to take out the oil mains. But I don't smell like fish, <laughs> do I? How can I lure him around? <laughs> Bentley's taken up a post along the river. He'll keep tossing bombs into the water, and the fish should get blown sky high. Plenty should land near your position. Okay. So you want me to throw a fish at the oil main so that old grizzle face will knock him apart? That's the idea. You might even try throwing fish at the guards. Find a prudent odor. Ah, grizzle face. It's. As soon as I pick it up, he smells it. Nice work. Trot old Grizzleface over to the next oil main by luring him with fish. Did you just... Did you just smash? He smashed my fish! Okay, Bentley, give me the next fish. Oh, here comes Grizzleface. Okay, where's the next one? There's one over there. Probably is the best one to hit next. So, is he gonna, like, catch Grizzle up? Grizzleface has caught the scent. He's coming. Ooh, he he lost the scent because I don't. Hello, Grizzle Face. That bear can run pretty fast. He's on the way. He is. Sensors in the safe house indicate that Grizzle Face is on the move. I wonder where he is. Grizzleface is moving towards your position. Fire! 
fiery fist! Hey, I said fiery fist, darn it! I need a fish, Bentley. Bentley, I need another fish! The bear's coming. I wonder where he is. Was that him or is that a moose? That was a moose. Ah! <laughs> there he is! There you go, Grizzle Face. Nice and fresh. Bentley, next fish. Next fish, please. Okay, just gonna make my way over here. Faces caught the scent. He's coming. How did none of them see that? I don't know. Here he comes. Get him, big guy! Good job. Oh, thanks, Bentley. Luckily, he's not attacking me for fish. That would be bad. Well, the last one is over there. Whoop. Can't catch me, I'm the Murray. <laughs> okay. I think I lost him. Just gonna cross this bridge here. No enemies around, wait for the pike. Okay, uh, Bentley, I can use that pike. There it is. The sensors in the safe house indicate that Grizzleface is on the move. He's coming. Wonder how long it'll take him to get here. Pro oh, there he is. Grizzleface is moving towards your position. Oh, I see him. He's a coming. There he is! Come here, big guy! I got an oil main with your name on it! Solid work, Murray. Now that the oil lines are exposed, Sly's all set up for a paragliding job off the lighthouse. Murray, why'd you just put in your mouth? Murray! Oh, Grizzleface is gone. Also, the thing that Sly has been using to jump on that one ledge is now gone forever. Yay! Ah! Water! Cold water! That was not very nice! Okay, just gonna ignore, uh, the bear. Make my way back to the safe house for Bentley's mission. Just gotta make my way over there. Stupid icicles. Nearly hitting me. But I don't think Marie can get up there. Oh, okay. Yep! Eagles! Why is it always eagles? So many eagles. Okay, Bentley. You be careful, those things can pick you up. Haha! <laughs> Bentley flies over the eagles! Ka ka! Oh, there's another mission for uh, Sly. I didn't see that. Oh, we'll do the. We'll, we'll do Bentley's first. We're already out. We're already here. Oh, I love the little jetpack. Bear! I don't think Bentley can put the bear to sleep. Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep, little goat. Quack. I said quack!
Can I make this? Huzzah! <laughs> if we can trust Murray's informant, that's the silo with the battery hidden inside. All right. To prepare it for travel, we'll have to drain off its northern light energy. By attaching a boat's grappling hook to the top of the silo, we should be able to deplete power from the battery. Murray's in okay. position to help throw you out onto the boat. Oh, no. Once on board, I'll hack into its steering controls and move the vessel close enough to fire its grappling hook. <laughs> is, is it okay. more? Okay, I'll climb on top of the silo and attach the hooks. How many grappling lines will it take to drain the battery? Three should suffice. Once the first line's attached, Murray and I will commandeer another boat. You should stay in position. Finally, I get the easy gig. Not more throwing. Uh, anyway. I'm all set to throw you to that boat. These days, my aim is impeccable. Now to hack okay. the steering controls. All right. I'm in. No code can stop. But what are these? Well, there's nothing really blocking my path, so... uh. Oh! Oh, no, no. Oh, they're mine layers. Okay, I can blow them up. Mine layers? Interesting. Indeed interesting. Just gotta... Ooh. Oh, almost there. And gotcha. Hack complete. Nice work hacking the autopilot. That boat's heading into position. I'm already on top of the silo. Shoot the grappling hook up to me, and I'll make sure it gets attached to the battery. Hi, Sly. <laughs> okay. Now I just gotta take aim and boom. First try. The hook's in place. You guys should head out for another boat before anyone picks up on what we're doing. It's probably a good idea. Just keep running, just keep running. Nothing can stop us now. Me and Murray got this all. We have this in hand. Okay, Murray. Chuck me. Like the football I am. Huh. Actually, it's more of discus, actually. Never mind. Hacking time. Okay. Oh, more mines. Really likes his mines, doesn't he? Yep. Okay, that was... Yeah, I kind of rushed this one. For the self, do not rush the third one. Okay, got rid of that. That makes things a lot easier. Woo. Hey, I can make them bump into it. Interesting. Come on, fellas. Don't you want to bump into the, the firewall? Don't you know how fun that is? Just bumping into firewalls? Can I make it through this without dying? Maybe. Come on, come on. Almost there, almost. Yes! You have been hacked! Good sir. Sly, boat number two is on the way. Take aim and fire! I'm getting good at Second this. Hook's in place. One more grapple line to go, and this thing will be on empty. Good to hear. Okay. Wait, do we have to get up there? Or is that down there? Okay, it's down here. Oh. Well, we know what happened to the mammoth. Huh. 
I was wondering what happened to that guy. <laughs> Guess he just prefers to be frozen. Oh, that's sad. Oh, uh, last hack. I mean, I don't know if this last hack could be last hack. Might be last hack. This one might make take the most amount of time to get through. Okay, and there we go. Excuse me. Coming through. Nor me, I'm not here. Oh, there's another one. Just go around circles. Ow. I was hoping for a perfect, but I was robbed. Robbed. Ow. Robbed. Come on, fellas, just ram into this firewall. Makes the job easier for me. Come on. Woo. Oh boy. Four left. We got it. Woo. Coming over, DSLI. Just gotta make it through these buoys. Careful. Careful. What is that blueprint of, anyway? I'm quite curious. Okay. I don't want to get tangled up in the first boat. Bless you, Bentley. Bless you. Oh, we're still... We're still going? <laughs> okay, we're good. I guess we did need a good spot to, uh, get... Bentley off. The boat! Oh, I missed! Am I too high? I'm too high. Oh, okay! <laughs> You know? <laughs> that did it. With the battery chamber empty, we'll be all set to move in. Looks cozy. But I'm surprised sliding go. <laughs> Could've warned me, Bentley. Could've warned me. But Bentley didn't. Now, Sly, you shall fry! Okay, just, uh... One last mission, it's Sly's. Hey, pal. What you looking at? Nothing, that's what. Up, up, and away! Oh, his last mission's up there. I was like, where's Sly's last mission? On top of the lighthouse! For a fourth time! <laughs> We fly. Y'all look so small below the power of Bentley and his thruster pack. Okay, Sly. We have an egg to steal from these horrible birds who have been attacking us this entire level. Bye. No, nah. You know. I don't really like taking eggs from birds, but I'll make an exception for these eagles. <laughs> Slight exception. And whoop, there we go. Okay.
Okay, so it's, the eggs are over there. Okay. Please don't hit me. Please don't hit me. I don't like being skewered. And up we go. Okay. In order to overcome Jean Bisson in the Lumberjack games, we'll need to enlist the help of the giant Canadian eagles. Their nest is out on that iceberg. Steal one of the eggs, and then bring it safely back to the safe house. We'll use it to direct the eagle's protective instincts against Bisson. Sure, sounds easy enough. Except for the part where I have to swim a half a mile through freezing water. <laughs> Why swim when you can paraglide? With the oil mains all destroyed, the pent-up combustible materials have just caught fire. I see. The updraft created by the flame should give me some extra altitude. Just make sure to stay out of the fire. Get too close and old Grizzleface will be eating barbecued raccoon for dinner. That's a charming uh... image, Bentley. Also, okay, I understand getting out there, Bentley, but how do I get back? It's just a, a question I'm curious about. Like, getting over there is the easy part. Getting back, Bentley? Hmm? Get. Also, I thought Grizzleface was only like, oh, I know he was making a joke, but I was like, Sly is not a fish. <laughs> Oh, this also has to be very warm smoke, you know, like. <laughs> Just got to be careful. Just got to make the. The clipping of the the assets, the clipping of the assets is kind of weird. Okay, almost there. Last one. Just got it. Stay on target. Stay on target. Stay on. Up, up, and away! The world's first flying wreck. Uh. What? They're Watch coming at me. For those eagles, they don't look friendly. <laughs> no! I have to do it all again, don't I? That's why it was so easy to glide! The eagles! They come after you! The eagles! Why, eagles? Why? So do I have to, like, go around the only way, or can I just run over to the last one and just glide into it? Oh, I'm trying. Maybe I have to because I have to stay out of the fire. That makes more sense, actually, now that I think about it. Wow, I can see the exploding logs from here. Maybe. Yeah, I can! They're right there in the corner. Okay, just got it. Make my way. You got this, Sly. You know, I'd really like to see a remaster of the Sly Cooper games, like, you know, like how the how Spyro had a remaster and Crash had a remaster. The Sly Cooper remaster. That'd be nice. I'd buy it. Watch out for those eagles. They don't look friendly. Ooh. Whoa. Just gotta be careful not to glide. Okay, just probably gotta land on the... Oh. Hey, good thing this is here. I wonder if this actually used to be part of the uh, the mainland, or... Ah, oh, it's probably when the sea freezes over, someone came out here and climbed it, and then the eagles got mad at him and killed him. Murdered by eagles. Makes sense. Okay. Excellent job. If you can get that eagle egg back to the safe house, we'll be all set for the love. Job failed. Egg hit water. <laughs> That was my own fault. I, I hit the wrong button. Okay. Huh. Yep.
Hello, friendly Mastodon cube. Oop. Probably should be careful not to get the... I probably can't get damaged while having the egg, because if I get damaged, then I lose the egg. Oh, they're gonna show up here, I know it. Or... Great work, Sly! Or not! Okay! Job complete! Well done! Yeah! <laughs> no eagles can stop Sly Cooper! None. No eagles. No eagles. The Lumberjack Games are upon us! Operation now, Canada despite Games. Despite Murray's study of the long chopping guide, none of us are skilled enough to beat John Basson at his own game. So, though it pains me to say it, we'll have to cheat. Murray, yeah. you'll participate in the power log chopping competition. Get us a good score, and then let Basson up for his turn. While he's chopping, I'll sneak the eagle egg into his trousers, and the protective parents should disturb his axe swings. What? Fly, given your ascension skills, I've signed you up for the ice wall climb. Ah. We'll keep Hassan from beating your score by pulling him off the wall with some nearby grappling lines. Convenient. And finally, I'll represent our team in the log rolling competition. With my knowledge of rotational mechanics, we're sure to get a stupendous score. <laughs> Sly will be in charge of greasing Hassan's logs so he has no chance of beating it. If you guys are ready, I say we head out and show these meathead lumberjacks what we're made of. Okay, then. Who's going to start this job? Oh, it's a Bentley mission. Come on, Bentley, let's do this. Okay, guys, let's head down there and win those talons from Jean Bissot. Sly, try to keep a low profile when we get close. We don't want him to recognize you. That's probably a good idea. Wait, has he met Sly? Wait, he hasn't met Sly. Oh, he probably just knows what he looks like. That makes sense. Hi, Jean. Excuse me, sir. We humble lumberjacks would like to participate in your lumberjack games. Think you got what it takes to win the clockwork talons, eh? Well, I'm sure enough gonna let you play, so long as you pay the entry fee. Much obliged, partner. We'll, uh, just take our positions for the competition. Enjoy the moment while you think you still got a chance. It's as close to winning as you'll ever get. This year's first event will be okay. a power chopping contest. Oh, Murray. Not like anyone's ever gonna beat my record, but let him try. Oh, come on. Ooh. There we go. Give it all you got, Murray. It's just a log. You're the Murray. No log. Your technique is pathetic, Ooh. big man. Where'd you learn to chop? From a book? Uh, maybe. Prior for that mess up I had. It's a good thing to give you a second chance, you know? Not bad, <laughs> Hippo. But watch and learn as I destroy that log without even breaking a sweat. All right, then. Do your best, John. Okay, Bentley, you're on. Plant the eagle egg on Basson, and the angry eagle parent should swoop in and throw off his axe timing. Well, it's a good thing I have a... Woo! Yeep! <laughs> you know, I thought the jetpack would actually give me an advantage here, but I can't seem to jump. Oh, I get ya. Luckily, this ice moves back and forth pretty, uh, pretty specifically. Convenient. Convenience, the name of the game. Go. Whoa. What? No! 
That one was acting a little weird. I bet it was probably supposed to do that. Oh well, let's go try this again. Ooh, they're, they're coming in hot. It's a good thing Bentley runs so quickly. Okay, on the ice. Yeah, it does just move like that, okay. Kind of threw me off there for a second because I wasn't expecting it. So I'll stay at the end here so I'm ready for when this thing comes over. Okay, wait for it. Wait for it, and walk! Woo! Come on, Jean. There we go. Here, free you, Gleg. All for you. Oh, I just, they probably want it back. What? I think you better rethink them scores, boys. What you intended to give me was perfect tens, right? Oh. Yeah. So your pink friend knows how to handle an axe. Let's see how you handle a vertical wall of ice. Why is this part of the Lumberjack games? That's my question. I mean, I kind of... Whoa! I'll be honest, I was not expecting that. Pretty good for a scrawny raccoon. Now, watch and learn as I demonstrate the art of power climbing. One of them has a shiny pocket. What the heck? I can't First, get it. Use those grapples to hook out to be sawed. You will need to hook it with all three lines to pull them off the wall. Well, time to hook us a pretty big fish. Oh, boy. My aim is bad. Well, I got one, but he's gonna get to the top before I can get the next one, isn't he? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. One of the best times I've ever had. Well, let's try that again, shall we? Okay, Jean. Come on. Oh, I, I, I suck at this. Come on. No. Now that's how it's done. Okay, then. Oh, got one. I only got two. Now that's how it's done. <sighs> but in our timeline. Okay, got one. Got two. Got three. Down he goes! I wonder if he actually felt the hooks in his backs. Like, there's something in my back, man! It seems you have pulled the wrong cards again. Did I ever tell any of you the story about the judge from last year's competition who mistakenly gave me a score other than ten? Oh boy! I see we're tied with only one event to go. 
Unfortunately for you, I've saved my best event for the last. The spinning log competition. Okay, looks easy enough. I just need to stay out of the water. Uh... Okay then. Nope! Woo! Made it. Just gotta keep rolling. Just keep rolling, Bentley. Just keep on rolling. Just keep rolling, just keep rolling, just stay on the log, Bentley! Oh no! You disgrace my competition with that performance. Why the four? I think it's pretty good. You disgrace my competition with Okay, that, that one's fair. That was like the first the first log. Okay. Just keep, just, just, just stay on target. Come on, Bentley. You know rotation, or Enjoy not? A dip in them icy Canadian waters. A little bit. A little nippy. Wish I could use a backpack. But I'm pretty sure I'd be disqualified. I'd pull out the thruster pack. Woo! <laughs> Almost there. Almost there. Oh! Okay. Doing fine. Doing. Perfectly fine. Sure one lucky turtle. I'll give you that. But now, watch how a skilled log roller does it. This is crazy. John Besson's got those judges so intimidated, there's no way he can lose. You're right, Murray. Those guys need to go. Huh. Okay, I'm just making this up on the fly, but... What if I were to lure the judges one by one into that cave? Once inside, you two will knock them out and take their clothes. Ingenious! When all three judges have been restrained, we'll be able to don our disguises and take their place at the judges' table. Sly, you can use the alarm clock gadget to distract the judges and lure them into the cave. That's a great plan, Sly, but you'll have to move fast. Once John Besson finishes the log rolling event, the gig is up. Okay. Well, I need to equip the uh, the alarm clock shit, alarm clock gadget, don't I? Go, go, go! Go, go, go! O, I, E! <laughs> Wait, did we take that bill? What? We just stole the bill! Here he comes! Get in there! Okay. Go, go. Oh, you heard that. Ooh, ooh, ee, mm. <laughs> This is not going to work, guys. This is not gonna work. Come on. Come on, get in there. All right, oh, yeah. give me that. Take your bill. This is so silly. The hats! Slice hat! What? 
I thought I warned you judges about the consequences for incorrect scores. Wait a second. You aren't the judges I hired. Uh. It's the scrawny raccoon and his annoying friends. Uh. Well, if you want the talent, then why don't you just take them? Oh, jeez. Actually, he... <laughs> Bentley's still up. But, like, he hit Murray in the head. Talon first. Oh, that could have killed him. Head. Those Talons really pack a punch. Sly! Murray! Wake up! Yeah, I'm awake, but not so loud. I have a splitting headache. Oh. Where are we? What's going on? This looks like the sawmill control room. Hmm. Bisan must have thrown us in here for interrogation later. I, for one, would like to escape before he returns. It looks like we're pretty well sealed in here. Unless... Unless what? Unless uh. you can fit through that hole. I... I think I could squeeze through there. I'll drop down and try to free you guys from the outside. If there's any trouble, I'll call with this walkie-talkie. You might be able to help me with these sawmill controls. While you guys do that, I'll try prying open that steel door. Given enough time, I might be able to make some progress. Sounds good. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. Good luck, Bentley. And remember to shout if I can help you from up here. All right, in we go. Oh, it, it, ah, ah. Bentley, you okay? That went well. I can't see you from in here, but I heard the fall. I'll be fine. Just give me a moment to catch my Aww. breath. Well now, Candy Bridges, I should have figured a puny turtle like you'd find a rat hole to squirm through. Well, I just dropped my glasses, had to come pick them up. I ain't like you, boy. I ain't stupid. When y'all were unconscious, me and my boys paid a visit to your hideout and found all them clockwork parts. What? But the thing, too. Arpeggio is willing to plunk down a king's ransom for the whole lot. I even threw in the talons. You sold all the clockwork parts? Arpeggio has them all? I wouldn't expect one of your kind to understand the finer points of commerce. Uh, turtles are too stupid to know a woodcutter from a woodchuck. That's it. Time I showed you just how stupid we turtles really are. Sly, on my command. I hear you. Prepare yourself, Bissad. On guard. Okay, Walnut. Get ready for a smushing. He sold all of them? Logs. Done. Ow. Okay. Fire. Flames. How's that? Come on, John. Ooh, that has got to hurt. Flames. Flames. Well, that didn't work. Okay. All right. Log to the head. Come on in here, boys. Let's get this varmint. Oh, he brought friends. He brought friends, guys. Fire! Bam! Flames! Flames! There you go. Woo -hoo. Ow! Sizzle his gizzle! On it. More fire, please. Sauce? Okay, that did not work. Sauce! Yep. Flames! Flames! 10 4. Would you you mind dropping the log on him? Logs. How about again? Another log to the skull! Oh! He does not like that log. That lo Ow, okay, yeah, logs don't like me either. Okay. <laughs> so many logs! I love it! Dynamite turtle! Beat what? Wait, what, what? Oh god, he has dynamite! Oh no! Take that, puny little turtle. Ow! My pride. Call okay. Which lever I should pull. Drop Take that. Log to the head. Log to the head. Run. 
name of Sizzle. Okay. Also more log. Come on in here, boys. Let's get this varmint. Uh, can I say no? Like, guys, how about we don't come in here and get me? This this varmint doesn't want to be get. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. I'll take that. Fire. That's got a sizzle. Sauce, sauce. Flame up. Done. Flames. I hit the wrong button. Sauce, sauce. In that time. Woo. Log. All right. That's going to give you one heck of a headache. <laughs> hit him again. Hit him again. <laughs> More log slide! Dynamite turtle! How about I don't? Explosives are my thing, John! There you go. Log! Log! On fire! <laughs> you remember your friend the log? You wanna say hi? Come out, boys. Let's get to killing. Oh, he is out for blood. <laughs> that has gotta hurt. Oh, that was me. Fire yep. Log, log. Ooh. And he is down. Tarnation. I've been done in by some four-eyed turtle. Times have changed. Once again, brains triumph over brawn. With a little help from your friends. Good job, little buddy. <laughs> that was some fast thinking. Don't forget about me. You did a great job opening that door, Murray. Thanks. Uh, attention, uh, John Besson. Arpeggio's uh, carrier blimp will uh, arrive to pick up the Northern Light battery in exactly one minute. What? Okay, enough patting ourselves on the back. If we're going to get the clockwork parts back, we need to get onto that blimp. The silo battery isn't far. If we run, we can make it. Enough talk, let's move! Gotta hustle! Gotta hustle! <gasps> Shake a leg! That blimp's on its way! Gold medal winner! Huzzah! We won the games! <laughs> Technically. <laughs> Go! Bentley! That gang will catch up! We're here, let's go! In we go! And up! Alright, move, move, move! In, into the hole! Job completed! Sly Bentley and Murray. Whew. As we shut ourselves into the Northern Light Battery, it became black. For a few long minutes, we just sat there in darkness. No one dared to talk for fear that John Bassan's men might discover where we were hiding. Time seemed to have stopped. And then, we felt it. We were being lifted up to Arpeggio's blimp. It was all so strange. The focus of all our schemes had been stolen from us. Our clockwork parts were gone. Looking around the inside of the battery, I knew we all felt it. Failure. I was twitchy and ready for action. Any action. Bentley tried to make some sense of the situation by drawing up meaningless plans. But Murray? Murray took it the worst. Aww. He just sat there sobbing while the team van floated away over the horizon. That van was his life. I knew I'd have to find a way to make it up to him. How? How is the van floating away? Oh, that's a... That, that's not good. <laughs> well, thank you all for joining me. Remember to tune in next week when we take on the final episode, episode 8. Anatomy for disaster. 
Till then, stay classy, Internet. Doodles!